You're watching ABC 13 News, award-winning coverage of Lynchburg, Danville, Bedford, Roanoke, and the New River Valley. And welcome back on this Sunday evening. If you were out and about earlier today, you may have just maybe seen a little bit of that sunshine out there. Hopefully you got a chance to see that because as we head through the day on the King holiday, it is going to be a cloudy, cool day for us. And we are even tracking rain here on the map this evening. Now the rain looks like it's mostly going to be out of here by around nine o'clock tomorrow morning. But until then, periods of rain from time to time. So if you are going to be heading out this evening, you'll definitely want to keep the rain gear handy. Nothing especially heavy, but we do have those rain showers moving through. And you see in Lynchburg right now, it is dry, but just south of Bedford here between Bedford and Smith Mountain Lake and around Hud Huddleston, we do have some light rain showers moving into the Evington area of Campbell County, also in and around Alta Vista, and then also into Franklin County, Rocky Mount, and into Floyd. That's where we do have a little bit more widespread rain and that will continue to make its way into Henry County. So those of you in Martinsville will begin to see some raindrops within the next hour or so. But again, this is hit or miss. Not everyone going to see complete rain from now all the way until tomorrow morning, but periods of rain from time to time. Something we will not have to worry about is freezing rain through the overnight hours as temperatures will not fall much at all overnight. Right now it's 45 degrees in Lynchburg, still holding in the lower 50s here in Danville and in Martinsville. It's 43 in Hot Springs, so even the highest mountain locations fairly mild for this time of year. 47 in Blacksburg and 51 there in Dublin and in Hillsville. So you see for this evening, the rain showers will be out there and temperatures slowly falling into the lower 40s by around midnight tonight. And here on Futurecast, you can see how it is showing those rain showers moving through even into the overnight time frame and early in the morning on Monday, the rain showers a possibility for us. But as we head into the lunchtime time frame, all of this is gone, but a lot of white here on the map indicating it is going to be a cloudy day for us. And with the clouds, temperatures will hold in the 40s. And then for our Tuesday, more rain, but Maybe by Wednesday afternoon, some sunshine definitely on Thursday. You'll see that reflected on the seven day forecast. So for tonight, chilly with areas of rain, a low of 36 in Lynchburg, 38 in Danville, 37 in Roanoke. For central Virginia, some rain showers early in Bedford, Lynchburg, Amherst, Lovingston, and Dillwyn. 40s for highs in Appomattox, Rustburg, Alta Vista, Smith Mountain Lake, Gretna, Brooknell, Charlotte Courthouse. Early rain showers in Danville, cloudy and cool for the afternoon in Roanoke and in Blacksburg, 43 the high in Lexington. Another round of rain likely on Tuesday, but at least it's mild in the 50s. Early rain showers on Wednesday, but then by Wednesday afternoon, some breaks of sunshine. Definitely some sun back in the forecast on Thursday. Highs mild in the upper 50s. More rain showers Friday into Saturday morning and more rain in the forecast for Sunday. So a very unsettled weather pattern we have here. However, temperatures above freezing. Exactly. No worries about exactly. any ice or snow. I know a lot of you out there want the snow. <laughs> I like the snow. But it Controversial, doesn't look like the next seven days is going to bring any at all. Well, I appreciate you letting us all know that we need our rain jackets for the first couple days of this week. You'll need it. Thank you, Matt.